Welcome to the Pharma Voice 100 one on one video series with Taryn Grohm. Chris, so good to see you. Thank you so much for joining us for the Pharma Voice 100 Celebration Marathon. Taryn, thank you for having me. It's our pleasure. Chris, as chairman of BioNJ, what is the biggest trend you are tracking right now for companies in the biotech sector? Great question. Uh, obviously, as chair of BioNJ, we track a lot and trend a lot of different areas. But I'd say, like many, probably the biggest would be the COVID-19 impact on life science companies in the state, uh, whether it's development, especially with the execution of clinical trials, operations, with essentially all business being virtual now, our new normal, and phasing discussions for how and when is best for New Jersey life science companies to open their offices again. It's been a difficult time for all, both professionally and personally, but I must say it also put on full display for the world just how how remarkable our industry is in responding to unmet need. The speed, knowledge, collaboration has been quite remarkable to see, as well as the government response and support during the pandemic. I couldn't agree with you more. It has been amazing to watch companies come together. Uh, what might not be natural foes are now collaborators, and that's all for the greater good. So kudos to all of you who are leading that effort. Um, as president and CEO of Solenogenics, what qualities do you look for when you're putting together your executive team of leaders? You have tremendous leadership qualities. What do you look for in others? You know, obviously, it goes without saying that experience and competency in your job function is critical. But as you know, with biotech, you must be able to multitask and think extremely well on your feet. What I I like to also refer to uh, intestinal fortitude. This job isn't easy. You get knocked down quite a bit and have to get up and keep moving forward. So these qualities are critical. But uh, probably another very important quality is diversity in my work staff. I truly believe it fuels innovation. Having different perspectives and looking at a situation or problem is absolutely critical to success. Excellent. Chris, thank you for spending a few minutes with us. I know that these are a new reality, and thank you for joining us. Uh, Karen, uh, thank you, and, and congratulations for another uh, very productive and successful year at Pharma Voice. For more Pharma Voice 100 content, visit www.pharmavoice100.com.